Hello everybody, welcome to Digital Painting and Photography channel. This is Toshi Yagi from beautiful little island, Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer, I shot this image long time ago, 35mm black and white headshot. And I changed, well, I used the neural filter to colorize this image to get this colorized image from this black and white to color pretty good nice skin tone and everything's so good huh that's amazing good good job okay then I have this pencil drawing type image by find edges okay this is my subject today and uh, let's get started okay let's find out something interesting image okay color burn that's nice always okay let's see overlay pink light pretty interesting yeah kind of interesting nice illustration 70% Well, luminosity This is pretty nice too Half tone About 65 Pin light wise 70 I think pin light has some more greens But luminosity Doesn't have nice clean colors well, in this case, maybe using luminosity vector image as a base image, then darken these colors as a base image instead of using pin light. Maybe that's better idea. Okay, let me see. Leave this luminosity vector image. This is the base image make group then uh, okay base image is luminosity effect image light image then I'm gonna add okay duplicate this base image then uh, change blend mode to overlay pretty nice contrast about half Okay, flatten this overlay effect image. Okay, just leave it. Then uh, I'm gonna add white layer over this base image. Okay, fill this layer with white. Okay, and add mask. Okay, now turn off this overlay effect image and uh, Reveal this white layer with drawing to evolve. Okay, big size, then real thin. Okay, from here, I'm gonna use, well, let me see this overlay effect image. Change blend mode to. Let's see if I want a lighten image. Look at this color. Very nice. Real saddle colors. Pure color. Nice. Overlay effect image change blend mode to color. Well, without this white layer. Looks so nice as a base image, isn't it? Instead of this, less color, more and some subtle nice color. So if I move this overlay effect layer, just down the white layer. This is base image and I add white layer. That's pretty cool, huh? That's pretty nice. Okay. In this case though, just leave to use this as a base image. So
so just change this name okay this is luminosity 50 image so just let me see if I change this opacity yeah about this much okay then we get to this group image three layers of this image now let's see okay I'm gonna add layer gray uh, gradation color layer over this white layer with mask invert this mask okay now I'm gonna fix some of this mask okay now make window for gradation color okay make a little window let's see okay about this ring okay add some interesting colors okay i'm gonna fix i can fix this window later on so real tiny window Okay, let's see. Let me see this well, gradation color. Add gradation color with airbrushing to soft brush. Okay, another window. Okay, add color. Let me see, just add color first. Then add window. Okay, and color. Okay, let me see, play, little one, little window. Okay, kind of interesting. Let me see a little window again. Okay, I want to add one more gradation color layer. Alright, with mask. Invert this mask. 
now I want to make a window. Let's see, evolve. Okay, then add color here is white. Okay, erase tool, soft brush. Okay, just for now, I'm gonna continue to add colors. Hmm, so far pretty interesting. That's nice colors. Okay, fix this mask. Now I still have saddle colors. Okay, now let's see about, well, I want some dark image on her, maybe eyes, face, so, okay, let's see, I'm gonna duplicate this overlay effect image, it's only color blend mode right now, so it's not gonna show up the density much, it's only for color, so duplicate this overlay effect image just changed blend mode to see maybe okay color burn or linear burn maybe linear burn and tone down okay pretty much dark enough so now I'm gonna make mask then invert this mask all right then reveal this image to show a little more darkening image. Now I'm gonna use texture again. Evolve. Let's see from opacity half. Okay. From now. Um, let me see, I'm gonna fix the overall image, like mask. Now from here, not much change colors, just maybe shape of mask. Yeah, mm, pretty much. Let me see, just wanna try how about this ring? Maybe show up some more somehow. Let me see. So some interesting texture or something. To sh how can I make it inter interesting? Okay, how about one more gradation color? Only for a ring, then add mask invert this mask then again use brush now let me see real small i don't know just a touch okay how about no just clear and let me see just add brush texture like so yeah let me see then add color Hmm, kind of interesting. Well, let me see. Change brushes. Add. Okay, clean up this color here. Eraser tool. Now add. Well, let me see, mask, hmm, come from this base image, dark image, okay, this is base image, okay, how about 
add color over here. Let's see, red. Well, that doesn't show nice shape, huh? Okay, that's pretty, mm, it's not easy, huh? Well, let me see, that's a fix. Okay, well, that's it. Yeah, it's kind of fun. Uh, this is it. Now, so much little details here, huh? Okay, all right. From here, original image is black and white image, and I got a uh, neural filter, AI colorized image, really nice skin tone, very nice, and uh, add pencil drawing type image to change brand mode to luminosity to get this image, real saddle illustration type image as a base image, then I add overlay effect image. Um, pencil drawing type image to get add some color change blend mode to color to get this nice color actually this is the base image and uh, and it's too thin images so I add some dark part with overlay effect image same layer I mean uh, same image same layer, yes, and uh, change blend mode to linear burn with mask to get this much. This is dark image with mask, this area. Then over this image, add white layer with mask, white layer with mask to get this is the image. Then I add colors gradation colors and one for surrounding and one for ring then add some ring background gradation like so just a touch i don't know if it's gonna show up some kind of shiny image well that's it yep that's it for today and uh, thank you for watching my video i really appreciate for you guys support and uh, i hope you're gonna find some idea for your creative work and uh, you really thank you and you guys have a nice day and see you next time bye now ciao good day